Well, they've been around for hundreds of years, a part of your home you can probably take for granted. But a father and son team in Bourbon County knows how important those lightning rods are. As John Sullivan shows us, they've turned lightning strikes into a family affair. Thoroughbred horses, barns, open farmland, trees, thunderstorms, lightning. Hopefully, the lightning will not harm the horses, barns, trees, or other structures or livestock. If Bill Henson and son Brad Biddle of W.M. Henson Lightning Protection have anything to do with the situation, no problem. In the, the, the 45 years, 48 years that, the, that our business, that we have been in business, and uh, I know for a fact the, the 23 that I've been doing it, I've never had a call on a loss. We're in the business of installing lightning protection, and surge protection. This traveling on camera and microphone visited with the Henson crew as they installed lightning protection on a Bourbon County farm. Ben Franklin invented lightning rods in 1753 and by 1758 were in use in Philadelphia. We protect a lot of trees. Uh, we protect a lot of barns and horse facilities. Henson says more and more businesses and private homes are realizing how important lightning protection is. Uh, computers are so lightly wired that the slightest bit of surge can completely ruin your computer, fax machine, answering machine, garage door openers. Lightning can strike a distance of close to two miles. All this happens in three one hundredths of a second. Bill Henson says this is the end result. A copper attraction spear, copper wire, fitting into the bottom of this. This attracts the lightning and saves the structure or the tree. On the back roads in Bourbon County, John Sullivan traveling on. Boy, that's fascinating. Neat deal there. Absolutely. And we're